Underneath those. Okay. Yeah, Aaron, 295. Picked up this stuff for $43 at this latest estate sale. Some pretty good items to look out for. And one really good item that you probably would not guess. So paid $15 for this uh, electric typewriter. Goes for around $40. Flint, Flint uh, well, called Echo. Uh, spatula, deep fry spatula. Haven't seen a deep fry flipper spatula thing from Echo, so I picked that up. Got all this stuff for a dollar each. Uh, Singer, I believe. Nope, these are cloths. Uh, scissors. These are Wedgeway. Haven't heard Wedgeway, but for a dollar they looked decently well. This I'm not really sure what it is. It looks like a canner opener. Easy lift, it's called. Looks like the, to get the tops off of canning jars. This is pretty neat. This is a nutmeg um, grinder, I believe it is. Put the nutmeg in there and then just grind it. Cheese grater. Made in West Germany. Picked up these cufflinks or something like that. But paid a little up for them, $12. They are silver though. It's harder to see. You have to lift this clip up and it says 925 right there. Upside down. 925. So. Pretty good pickup. 
Radio Shack um, police scanner. Paid $4 for it. Goes for 17 These are all Terapeak average selling prices. Um, Flint Echo spatula. These go for 10 to $15. Paid a dollar. Best find right here. These scissors. If you don't know what you're looking for, a lot of people miss these. I was 121st in the line and these were still available. Cutco scissors for $1. I've sold many Cutco scissors in the past. They are selling around $60, $65. Wild. That, those scissors will pay for everything that I bought here. Good pickup. Is there?